Hello everyone. Welcome to this video lesson. In this video lesson, we are solving a problem from a topic called gravitation. Let me read out the problem first. The problem is like this. A mass m is split into two parts as a small m and capital M minus small m. They are separated by a certain distance. What shall be the ratio of these two masses so that the force between them is maximum? That's the question is. Let's identify, try to solve the problem. This is what our mass m is. Now he is saying that I am dividing this mass into two parts. If one mass is small m, it is obvious the remaining mass will be capital M minus small m. Now you are keeping this small m at one place and the remaining mass capital M minus small m at one place separated by a certain distance. These are the two different masses that means there is a gravitational force between them. We know according to Newton law of gravitational force F is G M1 M2 by R square. This is the gravitational force as per the Newton law of gravitation. Now he is saying that this F has to be maximum. If the F has to be the maximum, its differentiation with respect to the variable mass has to become zero. That means what? df by dm has to be equal to zero. You know, in differentiation, if any function has to become maximum, its differentiation has to become zero. Taking that into consideration, d by dm of f. What is f? g m m minus m by r square has to be equal to 0. If this has to be equal to 0, as g and uh, r square are not variables, they don't vary with mass, has to be equal to 0. d by d m of capital M small m minus small m square equal to 0. Differentiating this capital M minus 2m equal to 0 because this is nothing but dm and dm and capital M because its value is capital M and differentiation of m square equal to 2m since we have a formula differentiation of x power n equal to n into x power n minus 1. The differentiation of m square is 2 into m power 2 minus 1. That's nothing but equal to 2. We know this. That implies as capital M minus 2m equal to 0, capital M equal to 2m are small m equal to capital M by 2. So it simply tells you that the mass has to be distributed into two equal parts. Therefore, the force between the two particles will be automatically maximum. If you want the ratio of small m by capital M, its value will be automatically half or capital M by small m will be automatically 2. This is how I have to distribute the mass so that when they were separated by a certain distance, gravitational force between them will be maximum. Thank you for watching. Keep coming back for more and more video lessons. Thank you.